All right. Oh my gosh, I am so excited. <laughs> Hi guys, I hope you're all having an amazing day. In today's video, I will be unboxing this pretty big mystery beauty box. I have no idea what's in here, but uh, my sister-in-law sent this to me and I wanted to sit down and unbox it here with you guys and show you everything that's in there. I did ask her if that was okay. She said yes. So yes, I am super excited. Let's go ahead and get started. So a little context <laughs> about this box before I like open it up. Um, <laughs> she was going to send this to me as a Christmas gift and <laughs> um, she kind of forgot and she said she was just going to add a bunch of things in here. Um, so this is like a late Christmas gift slash now it's going to be like a Valentine's Day gift. At least that's how I'm taking it because you know my husband still hasn't asked me to be his Valentine's like so rude um like does he even like me i don't know we're married but do you do you you haven't asked me to be a valentine's um <laughs> okay i see some stuff already i see pink so i'm excited oh okay let me put this down and just start getting things out this is a lot of stuff oh my gosh kaylee oh my gosh <gasps> you got me some kylie makeup you guys <laughs> okay i have not tried anything from kylie um except for the liquid lipsticks so what is this let's see this is the kylie jenner try it kit i actually really wanted to get this um so i am so so excited thank you so much kaylee i just i just want to say thank you for everything i'm gonna want to say thank you for every individual item so to avoid myself from you know repeating myself i want to go ahead and say thank you <gasps> it's so pretty yes all right so we got the blush out this is in the shade we're going shopping oh my gosh you guys i am so excited because i've been wanting to try out kylie cosmetic uh items for a while and i just hadn't done it i always back out oh that looks so pretty this is definitely very much like my type of blush shade because i love like orangey or coral y shades um so let me just you know do a little swatch swatch oh my goodness that is gonna look so so gorgeous <laughs> I am this is gonna this is probably gonna be a pretty long video I was about to say oh this feels like Christmas but I mean <laughs> it kind of is okay um so this is the um what is this an eyeshadow duo yeah so this is an eyeshadow duo it has a metallic shade and a matte shade so that is what that looks like I love her packaging it is like the cutest ever let me do a little swatch a little swatch swatch yes i could even use that as highlighter that looks so beautiful you guys i'm already like <laughs> loving everything yes oh okay so i just swatched the other shade that could be like this itself could be contour blush and highlighter like i'm just saying i want to have this on display this is like extra special because she got it for me i'm just so happy right now okay so this is the lipstick this is in the shade uh oh i'm sorry this is the lip liner what am i saying um this is in the shade iced latte Ooh, yes that's gonna look really pretty it's a very pretty neutral shade and then this is the liquid lipstick this one is in the shade bear or bear velvet or is the liquid lipstick velvet i don't know but <laughs> we're gonna do a little swatch oh that's so pretty that looks a lot like the one I have right now, except a bit lighter. Okay, yeah, that doesn't look like the one I'm wearing right now. This one's completely different, but mm, oh, her lipstick smells so good. Did I get any on my nose? No. Okay, so that's the lipstick. It looks really, really pretty. And then the other lipstick, and this is your typical, um, I don't know, regular lipstick. This one is in the shade Almost Friday. And it is a matte lipstick that looks very pretty yes oh i'm gonna rock this for like valentine's day or something that is so beautiful 
Thank you so much. Okay, let's put this away now and go ahead and move on <laughs> to the next item. I don't know what I don't know what to pick. So moving on, we have the Elemis Pro Collagen Mar Marine Marine Oil, and this is an anti-wrinkle face oil. Yes, thank you, thank you so much. I have a two-year-old and. <laughs> It gets a little stressful sometimes. So I've been noticing a bit more like fine wrinkles, especially around my eye area. And I am very interested to try an oil. I don't have any oils in my skincare. Um, like when I do my skincare. So in my skincare routine. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. It replenishes, nourishes, and smooths. Yes, please. I need that in my life. This is the second item. And I'm already like... You went all out, sis. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Like, what did I do to deserve you? I don't know. Okay, moving on. We have the Dr. Brandt's Pore Refiner Primer. Ooh, a primer. This is exciting because I am obsessed with my e.l.f. putty primer. So I definitely, you know, need to try out more primers. I need to keep trying new things because once I try something, I tend to get stuck on it and that's all I want to use. So this says that it minimizes the look of pores, it absorbs oil, and it mattifies shine. Okay, perfect. So this is a mattifying primer, which is great because I do have oily combination skin. Wow, and this is like, this is a pretty nice size too. Yes. Okay, I kind of want to see what it looks like. <laughs> okay, so it has like a little pump situation going on here. Oh my gosh, can you guys tell I am so excited? I'm so sorry if I become super annoying in this video. I I think I just get annoying when I get excited. Um, okay, so that one is... Ooh, it's got some tint to it. So it's got like a... It's very close to my skin tone, actually. I just wanted to see what it looked like. What it smelled like. It has an interesting smell to it. It's a little strong, but... Ooh, that feels very smooth. This is probably going to be quite poor feeling, so that's good. It feels nice. It feels really soft. Ooh. I should have left my face, like, bare so that I could have tried out these items today. Why didn't I do that? I don't know. I'm... I'm I'm questioning past me for my, you know, decisions. But, okay, oh my gosh, I hadn't, oh, uh, okay, I just saw something. Again, I'm sorry, I get annoying when I'm excited. <laughs> but you guys, really? Are you serious? This is for me? Are you sure I can keep it? Okay, so this is the... <laughs> For those of you guys that don't know, this is the Alyssa Edwards Anastasia Beverly Hills palette. Um, I actually really, really wanted to try out this palette, but at that point, I think I was like just buying too many eyeshadow palettes, so I had to kind of like, you know, chill out and, you know, just control myself and not buy every single palette that came out. But this palette is, oh my gosh, the shades look so beautiful. I love colorful eyeshadow palettes. Oh my goodness. Look at this beauty. This is so, so beautiful. I really want to like do swatches of all of these because look how freaking gorgeous these are. But I, I feel like that would make the video too, too long. But I do want to swatch at least this one. This is in the shade DDG. And I just got some on my finger. That's a really nice purple shade. Whoa, look at that pigment. Oh my goodness. Yes, I love it. I love it. I am so excited. I just want to take a moment and book a flight, go to North Carolina, find my sister-in-law, and just like give her a hug and then just cry. Like, why are you so nice to me? <laughs> oh, okay. Mm -hmm. We're not going to do that. We're not going to get emotional right now. This is a happy moment. Okay, I'm sorry. But, you know, I don't have a lot of, like, actual friends because I am such a homebody. I am... Uh, I, w I used to say that I was really antisocial, but it turns out I just have really, really bad social anxiety. And I didn't really know that that's what it was. <laughs> um, 
So it's really hard for me to like actually make friends. Um, moving on to the next thing, we have a bronzer. This is from Bare Minerals and this one is in the shade Warmth. So I, I've also been wanting to try out more like bronzers and uh, blushes, just like more face things because I usually buy like a bunch of palettes. Like I have a problem with buying palettes. <laughs> so this is the Bare Minerals bronzer. I'm trying to open it and I can't. What's happening? Okay, there it is. So this is what it looks like. I feel like that's going to be a really nice shade for me. Yes. Ooh, that's pretty. I don't know if you guys can see it on camera, but it's definitely showing up right here in person. And that looks really pretty. And I don't have a lot of items from Bare Minerals, so that's also really, really exciting. Um, all right, so moving on, I see some lipsticks here. So I have a matte uh, lipstick from Ulta Beauty. This one is in the shade... I can't say this word. <laughs> um... <clears throat> hold on pomegranate is that how you say it maybe i don't know um i'll leave it up on the screen because i'm not sure okay so you can see the shade from well i don't know if you guys can see it but i can see the shade it's gonna be like a deep red but i do want to open it oh yes that is a very beautiful wine red it looks very smooth so thank you okay next all right, so we have, ooh, we have another one, and this one is in the shade Empowered, yes. Um, this is, this looks like it is a bright red. I like, this one has like different packaging. I'm not sure like what the difference is, but this one seems more like luxurious, and it feels a bit heavier too. Ooh, this looks like it's gonna be a really pretty red. I really, really like that. I thought this was gonna be more of like an orangey red. Um, here in person, it looks more like a cool tone red. So I love, love cool tone uh, red lipsticks. The orangey ones, I don't know, they, they're not my favorites, but the cool tone ones usually just like whoosh, suck me in. They just like get my attention. <laughs> All right, so moving on. Ooh, what is this? I have... What brand is this? Formula 1006? Is that is that the brand? I don't know. But this says Pores Be Pure Skin Clarifying Mud Mask. Um, and then it has a Dry It All Out Skin Detoxing Peel Mask. Charcoal Plus... Charcoal Plus Plum. Ooh. I really love that she sent me both makeup and uh, skincare. That is just like the sweetest. Oh. Okay, so, all right, so I'm just going to show you, you guys, what this is. I'm going to try not to, you know, talk too much about each individual product because that's what I've been doing, but all right. Okay, so this is what they look like. Um, this one says it is strawberry plus yarrow. I'm not sure what yarrow is. Um, I want to know what they smell like. Oh, <laughs> I was about to smell it, but it's sealed. Um, so let me see. That smells kind of good, but it also smells like lipstick. <laughs> I almost got some on my nose, but that's, I don't know. That's an interesting smell. Hmm, interesting. And then we have this one. I like this one just because it's pink. <laughs> All right, let's open it up. Mm -mm, this one. This one smells good. I can definitely smell the strawberry in this one. So yeah, I have these as well. I like just want to try everything out like right now. Like I want to take off my makeup and try out the skincare, try out the makeup. Like, oh my goodness. Okay, so next up, oh, you did not. You did not. You guys, I don't think I told her about me wanting to try this out, but I really, really wanted to. This is the e.l.f. Gleaming Loose Highlighter, and this is in collaboration with Nabella Noor. I'm really sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong. I really hope I'm not. <laughs> but uh, I was very intrigued about uh, this and then the lipstick that she came out with. So... I'm so excited. Okay, so this looks absolutely gorgeous. I did see a video. I don't know who it was, but somebody uh, was using this. They did um, an application. I was going to say a swatch, but they applied it to their face. And it looks so, so gorgeous. Um, 
it is sealed how am i gonna get this open i don't know hold please all right you guys i'm back i got it open so i do want to apply it on my face i do have some highlighter already but you know you can never have too much highlighter and i really want to see what this looks like so i said i wasn't gonna take my time with each individual product but <laughs> i'm genuinely genuinely excited about each product okay so. oh my gosh did you guys like you guys had to see that right like that was blinding yeah yes like you guys i was not kidding like when i saw this product like I, I wish i remember who it was that used it but when i saw this product in action i was like oh my goodness like i need that in my life and then i just like never actually got it but look at how pretty that is okay you guys so moving on we have this big item right here and let's see what this says this says sweet dreams it is a sleeping mask and what is this it is a uh, therapy Com comfort oh <laughs> i was trying to read it from up here but it says right there it is a lotion a sleeping mask and then socks i'm actually very intrigued because this says that it has lavender and valerian i don't I have no idea what valerian is but i know what lavender is and i know it's supposed to like you know help you just chill out you know if you're stressed out use some lavender it'll be soothing you know it'll be calming so i have had a little bit of trouble going to sleep lately so this should help me out um i feel like have you been reading my mind like okay soul sister i don't know how you uh, knew what i needed but thank you so much all right so moving on um the next item says what is this i don't know <laughs> top knot and double shot kind of day um yes what is this though oh it's hair ties and bobby pins okay i was like I, I don't know what this is but yes i can relate so here are the hair ties thank you i always lose my hair ties like where do they go i don't know same with the bobby pins i feel like they're always getting lost yes so you can never have too many hair ties or bobby pins because they just disappear like where do they even go that's a good question like what happens to them i don't know but this is pretty cool i think i'm gonna put all of my bobby pins in here um that way they don't get lost and i love that it says double shot because i <laughs> my husband always judges me when i go to starbucks and i order a coffee i always have to add like two shots so you know very very relatable okay so we have another lipstick oh yes girl you are you know just blessing me with all the lipsticks today if i can open it but this one is also from ulta beauty and it is in the shade tainted love oh this one is different i really like how vampy this is like i love this like especially for uh fall i know we're not even like in spring yet but i really love these types of like vampy colors i do feel a little bit like weird wearing them sometimes but the times that i have worn them you guys uh tell me that they look nice so like it like hypes me up and i'm like okay i'll wear more vampy colors but anyway so moving on i have something here from nars which is really exciting um i don't have a lot of things from nars i do have like their little um what are they they're like lipstick sticks that i got for my birthday from sephora a while ago and uh you know i felt all fancy because it was nars but Ooh, this looks like a very pretty shade. I love nude shades. I feel like you can never have too many nude lipsticks. Oh my gosh. That is like the perfect nude. Oh my goodness. It feels hydrating. Excuse me? <laughs> I wish I could try it on my lips, but I like... I would really have to work hard to take this off right now because it's the ColourPop liquid lipstick. But this lipstick is in the shade Dolce Vita. Dolce? Dolce. Dolce. <laughs> I don't know. 
<laughs> I'll leave it on the screen <laughs> before I keep embarrassing myself. So moving on, ooh, we have a liquid highlighter by Wet n Wild. This is the Hello Halo liquid highlighter in the shade... What shade is this? <laughs> Rosy and Ready. Okay, so I definitely want to swatch this because it is very intriguing. It looks very pretty and like a sparkly pink. Hello. I wonder if I could use this also like as a uh, like eyeshadow topper. Topper. <laughs> Can't tell. Oh, oh. I dropped a lipstick. <laughs> I'll be right back. Okay, the lipstick is okay. We're all good. But... Oh, let me blend this out. Once you blend it out, it, go it goes away a little bit. So it's not like super blinding. But if you want more of like a natural sheen, that looks really pretty. Um, oh, yes. Okay, so the last item. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Um, I totally forgot. I think she told me she was going to put this in the box. And I totally forgot that it was going to be coming with the box. Did she tell me? I think she did. I don't remember, but I am super excited. This is the Clinique Moisture Surge uh, 72 Hour Auto Replenishing Hydrator. I am obsessed with this. I love it. I feel like it just, it works so well. Like I said, I do have oily combination skin. So some moisturizers can be a little bit heavy, but this one is just like perfect. It just glides on. It feels really nice and it really moisturizes my skin. I don't know why I'm opening it because I already know, you know, what it, what it's like. And what it smells like it doesn't really have much of a scent honestly but that is what it looks like and i am obsessed with it um but yeah you guys that is it that was the last item in the box let me make sure though yep <laughs> so that was the last item in the box i am just so grateful. I am so happy, so excited about all of these items. Thank you again, Kaylee, for sending these out to me. You are the best. You are so sweet. I feel like you just know me so well. So that is it for today's video, you guys. Thank you so, so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. <laughs> if you enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!